You're probably having a bit of breakfast now. I myself have had a cheese omelette. You may be about to have bacon, eggs, toast, cereal, bit of fruit. Well, uh, check out what this next person has for breakfast. Big banana, una. She's known as Freely the Banana Girl, the Adelaide woman who's gained notoriety for eating as many as 51 bananas in one sitting. That's right, 51 bananas. A few years back, Freely even went for three weeks eating nothing but bananas. She now lives by the principle of only eating raw food before 4pm. And she's all for eating mono meals, big quantities of one kind of fruit or veg. This is an average breakfast for me. I would have either 10 to 15 bananas in a smoothie or I'd have 20 medjool dates. So I'm going to make this now, 20 medjool dates with some peppermint drops. Okay, so you just chuck the dates in, put a couple of squirts, squirt some water. So a lot of water. So you'd want about that much water. Put the lid on. It's a very, very healthy breakfast. Okay, and we blend. Freely's been eating like this for seven years. She's 23 kilos lighter and says she's not an exercise fanatic. It's like a creamy milkshake without the milk. But Freely claims she is healthier than ever. Okay, that's my breakfast. There you go. Well, um, Freely joins us now from Adelaide. Uh, thank you. It's a bizarre story. Do you really eat more than 50 bananas in a day? I have done. Yeah, definitely. I mean, generally I'd have over 30, but this particular time I had 51. Okay. How, what does that do to your body? People in the studio are, con are concerned about this. what that does. <laughs> well, it, no, it is actually very, very healthy. It makes you feel amazing, it helps you drop weight, and you know, it's, it's very, very good for you. So you follow the raw till four principle, only plant food, no meat, no dairy until four each day, then cooked high carb veggies for dinner. Is That's it, right. Is, is it, you, nutritionists are saying this is not good. I can imagine, I can imagine they are, but actually, just for this show, I got my blood tests. So all my blood tests are here and they're actually perfect. And that's after seven years on this lifestyle. So there's the theory and the, um, the practical results are that I've lost over 20 kilos. I've overcome chronic fatigue syndrome, irritable bowel syndrome, anorexia, bulimia, low thyroid function. So the proof really is in the banana pudding at the end of the day. Okay, you did obviously have had a lot going on there too. Now nutritionists say uh, there's not enough protein and too many carbs and sugar. That is an enormous amount of sugar you put in that blender there. It is, but um, every, every cell in the human body runs on glucose. All the trillions of cells in our body so we are actually high sugar creatures and that's what we thrive on you know that's why we have a sweet tooth and if it was too much sugar my blood tests would reflect that they would be bad and also I wouldn't you know look and feel as healthy as I am and also the protein one the World Health Organization back in the 70s actually discovered through scientific testing that we only need 2.5 percent of calories from protein and this lifestyle gives at least five percent of calories so I've got that covered. Okay, Freely the Banana Girl, you're doing something right because you look great. Thanks for joining us and Thank explaining so it much. this morning. Is she sponsored by me. the banana you, industry? Yeah, you're sponsored by the banana <laughs> I'm people. I'm not, I'm not. No. Oh. Definitely, definitely not. No, Don't I just want to help people. I just want to spread a healthy message. Okay. And yeah, just help people. Mm. There you go. There you okay, go. thanks Freely.